welcome back to my channel uh, I know it's been a while since I made a video uh, I've just been busy with work and not been really doing much around here uh, I did want to come on here and show you guys the goat pen I built I wanted to video it while I was building it but I was in a hurry and I just never got around to getting the tripod out and it's a lot of work making videos and I don't think I'm cut out for it, but I'm going to take you guys up here and show you the goat pen I built. This can also be used as a dog lot. Um, you'll need to use smaller whole wire if you build a dog lot out of it, if you got pups, but I'm going to take you up here and show it to you. All right, guys, there it is. I used pressure treated four by fours. I used uh, 48 inch cattle panels and what I did was I took the 4x4s, I bought 12 foot long 4x4 pressure treated. I cut each 4x4 in half at 6 foot. Then I buried 2 foot of the post in the ground with concrete. I just put one of these latches on it. Uh, braced it up. Now I will tell you one thing I'm going to do a little different. Sorry the wind's blowing really hard out here. On this, side, on this front corner, I am going to come over here somewhere and take out one of these T-posts and brace to this corner post right here just to help keep this post from going like this. Uh, but the goats love it. I've only got two goats. Built some little playground in there. I bought 16 foot long cattle panels. And as you can see, in between each post, each wood post, I braced it with T-posts. The way I attach to the T-post is I just use these stainless steel zip ties. The wood post, I use some uh, plumbing strapping staples. Another pallet, little pallet shelter. I just got two goats. They don't need a whole lot. I am going to build this all the way down to the woods. I thought this would be plenty enough for the goats to keep some fresh grass, but as you can see, they've done wore it out. I like the cattle panels for the goats. They can stick their head all the way to their shoulders through. I thought I was going to have to weed eat over here. And this is right barely off of my property line, as you can see from that post down there. And if you look down the edge of that, they stick their heads through the cattle panels and keep it mowed down all the way around their pen. I need to put a T-post in here. See how they push on that? I've not attached it here. I'll show you how I attached it to these boards around the top. Like right here, I drilled a hole on each side of this wire panel. I took a zip tie, ran it through and tightened it down. The wire panel is very tight against that board. you girls doing anyway huh what are you girls doing it's ruby and rosie what are you girls up to that's about the only thing i've did here lately i wish you had a 
took a video of me building it. The first pen I ever built that size. You can see them up there sticking their head out of there, eating the grass, pushing on my wire. Can't wait to get it built on down to the woods. This right here costed me, the cattle panels costed. Probably been better off using woven wire, but you don't have to stretch cattle panels. Uh, 300, right about 305 or $310 for the cattle panels. I had the T posts already laying around. They're probably five or six bucks a piece. Four befores, I can't remember how much they costed. I bought six, I think I bought six 12 foot four befores. Two pressure treated two before eights for the gate, some hinges and a latch. I just used the scrap cattle panel that I cut out of this front piece for the gate. But they sure do love it in there. And I hope this video gives you guys an idea of how to build you guys a, a pretty nice pen of, for any animal, really. If you have more than two goats, I would suggest going a lot bigger. This one is three 16-foot cattle panels long and one 16-foot cattle panel wide. but I am gonna go all the way to the woods. This was just to get them out of that little pen that I had them in. It was staying wet and muddy. and I just didn't feel right about keeping goats if I didn't have a, have a better pen for them to get in. It's pretty funny to watch them get up on there and bounce real high up in the air off of that thing. What are you girls doing? Looking up there at the fire I got going. But that's pretty much it guys. Maybe this will give you guys a good idea how to build one of these. Have a good one guys. Like and subscribe.